this video we are going to use the ESP32 camera for direct objects. By the end of the video you will have your ESP32 camera with a capable of object detection. Let's get started. Hi explorers, in this video we are going to use the ESP32 camera for object detection. For this we are going to use a simple software. camera for uploading the code. For uploading the code, you can just Arduino you know, or FDD adapter. If you don't have this, I already have this code called as ESP32 MV module. We can directly attach this together and we can upload the code. Our ESP32 is ready now. We can use micro USB cable for this. If you don't have this, you can check out our article. We gave full instruction to how to use Arduino you know, and FDD Data acquisition. Data acquisition means we want to collect large number of pictures, images in our ESP32 camera. We want to train the ESP32 camera by that image. If we want to detect tomato, we want to at least uh, we want to give 54 pictures in different angles and to this process. Large number of photos will increase the accuracy of the object detection process. For that, we are going to use a gimbals. Now, go to a gimbals. Now, we want to uh, name our project detected and our name as object detection. Now, our account is ready. Now, we are going, going to upload our images to uh, train our ESP32. If we want to Direct of tomato, we want to give uh, pictures of tomato. Click collect new data. If you scan this QR code, you can directly scan this QR code and take the pictures of object directly. Or if you want to uh, connect a uh, development mode uh, like ESP32 and directly take the picture from a chambers. Or if you have already have images on computer, you can upload directly. The easiest way is scan from QR code. So that I am going to do that now. Click scan QR code. And you have to redirect to a simple software directly. Then we want to collect images. Click collect images. Now our camera is ready. Now we can just take the pictures. Now first we are going to detect the orange. Then place the orange and click capture and rotate the orange in different angles. When you are capturing, image automatically upload to the edge embers account in your laptop. Try with the different angles. taking the pictures from your phone that automatically uploaded to your laptop now we are going to do labeling cube click labeling cube next we want to label the one by one frame the orange in the correct position name as orange then click serve label we are going to do for every image Sometimes it may be not in the frame, so that you want to resize this according to the image. After you are finishing all the images of one object next we want to click uh, so that delete that label and we want to add new label 
Okay. Now we serve that. Now we want to label all onion in it. We finish our labeling process. Next, go to create ring bulbs. You need to select on the target device. You don't uh, see the AI thingy ESP32 camera, so that we are going to select ESPI and then click create, uh, then custom, then click so click add image, click image, and add that. deduction and then click serve, serve impulse then go to image click uh, change color depth as gray scale then click serve parameters This will take some time. A few moments later. Then a uh, map uh, generated by this. You can see there's a little uh, difference between orange and uh, onion. But there are two onion images. Little bit. We don't have any problem. Then click object detection. Change the learning rate as 0 0.01. Then number of training cycles 6. We don't want to change any of them. This module. Then click no more faster. Click that. Click serve and train. This will take some time. You can see the training performance, we are get a good score, all are 100, so that we don't have any problem to detect any object. Then click deployment. Then search for Audino library. Then click that. Then click build. Now over Audino library is building after building automatically downloaded. Go to Audino ID and go to sketch and the zip file. Then go to download and add to a downloaded zip file. Now our library is successfully installed. Then connect the ESP32 to the laptop. Then go to file. Then examples. Object detection interfacing and ESP32 and select ESP32 camera. Then our code is open in the new Audino ID sketch. After that, uh, define the. Do you like AI thinker? Uh? 